hell um i thought i'd do a whole video today because it's been a while since i did my last one um this isn't any like specific kind of style that i've collected like my last one was Hime and Bodyline. Um, this is all random things that I've just sort of bought. There's some stuff that can fit into Japanese fashion, but a lot of it's been from like high street stores. Um, but my first item I bought is actually a brand item. Let's take it off. Well, hang on, because it looks ugly. I got this Liz Lisa top. I'm really bad at showing things. Um, and it's like. I don't know if you can see but it's made of really really soft material like it's like a dressing gown and it's really cute and yeah here's Lisa and I got this second hand for like nine pounds so I was like girl I ain't gonna pass on that and it's really warm and it's good for the winter and stuff uh, oh and I got this wig this is new oh look you can see <laughs> that's the thing with this wig like I realize it's really thin it's really cool because it's my first wig with like the flesh top thing but it's like it's quite thin and you can see like the netting and stuff but i paid like 10 pounds for it so what do you expect really um i also got this belt oh, show myself this belt from ebay as well um i got it for six pound i think like i really wanted a dyer belt but they're all selling for like 50 quid and I was like 50 pound for a belt girl I'll pay that for a dress so yeah I just got some kind of something that will work just as fine um, my next top I really wanted a long sleeve fairy k top um, but I'm really not sure about it because it's look how wide it is I mean the model in the picture she was really petite and small so and obviously it was like baggy on her but I thought oh, but it's like too baggy but the print's really cute I don't know I might sell it I'm not sure because I don't mind baggy things but you know when it's just like a sack and I, I don't know I'm very picky I've been trying to get into like is it Kuragao? Is this Kuragao? I don't really know what this style is like called. Because I thought Kuragao is where you tan your skin and grow out and tan. Um, but like, um, I've been looking at sort of Daya and um, the stuff that they wear. I don't know what it's called. Someone tell me. Anyway, um, yeah, I've been looking at that brand and buying pieces that look similar. Like this jacket. I found on eBay and it came with matching shorts so I was like ooh this top <laughs> down, down. um yeah this top I got from it's a Taobao store I can't remember the name um the model in it is Rulu An and I was kind of really inspired by her hence why I bought this wig because I was like I want to look like Rulu An um yeah so this is one of her tops that she sells and I got this oh god it's really hard to it's one of the crossover vest tops I got this on eBay and it's like asymmetrical and very see-through um, but I got it for two pounds so I was like ooh I ain't gonna pass on that <laughs> the next item I got I got from my friend Marie um, she was selling it second hand um, it comes with a skirt as well, but the skirt's in the wash, so, yeah. And it's really adorable. It's really cute. I like it. The print's really nice. Um, it's a replica, but... Over Christmas, um, I got a gift voucher for New Look, and I don't really shop in New Look. I don't know, I just don't find their stuff very exciting. But I found this in the sale. Originally it was 20, but I managed to get it down to 15 because some of the bits were missing. It's like a oops, I got it around the wrong way. It's like um a kimono in like a minty colour. And it's got a sparkly sheet on it, but a lot of the gems have fallen off. <laughs> I don't know, I, just, I really liked it. It's kind of a bit granny, but I really like grannies. 
that sounds really wrong <laughs> i mean i like granny style this i found in h&m how cool is it and um it's like chiffon i think that's no organza see it's see-through um this is see-through as well unless you want your boobies out it might look good with your boobies out but yeah i usually wear like a pink crop top underneath i just thought that it was really pretty it was in sale as well got a gift voucher for christmas so i finally got it and it's really cute it's like a really nice pink color and it makes your boobs look really nice um i also got some white disco shorts from ebay the waist is fine um and like around my bum is fine as well but the front like the crotch bits a bit saggy which is a shame I didn't pay that much for them but I'll still like get some use out of it just sort of wear something over over the shorts so you don't see the saggy crotch uh this I got in sale from Miss Elfridge oh how cute is it it was originally £50 I got it for 30 and I still think £30 a bit steep for like a clutch bag but look at it it's it's really soft and it has a chain if you want to put it over your shoulder it's a bit long though when I put it on my shoulder it hangs like down my knees so yeah just have it as a clutch bag it's so soft it's like it's like walking around with a cat then I also got this from eBay. It's like a dog tooth cardigan and it has waist ties which you can do at the back or the front. And I also got like a blue um a blue wig and it looks really nice with this. Because I like bright coloured hair with like black clothes. I think it looks real pain. I got this from Miss Selfridge as well. I've been after a big black hat for a long time. I like how I pause. It's like a big black hat <laughs> um, for like a really long time. And I have a really small pea head, so nothing fit me. But yeah, I was so happy. And it's really nice. Um, then I found this in Primark. It was on sale for £3. And I don't know, I just thought I could do some stuff with it. I like layering things and three pound you can it go wrong and then I also got one in black as well and it's quite sparkly actually I don't know if you can see it doesn't really show on webcam then lastly I'm not, actually there's like more things that I've bought but I literally can't remember oh I got stuff from Bodyline I'll get those in a sec then I got this bag from Primark, which was also on sale. I think it looks really nice for Primark. I've seen this on eBay actually, and I was going to bid on it. Someone was selling it for like £12, and they were like, oh, it's a designer bag. It was originally like 25 and saying all this shit, and I was like, mate, it's from Primark. I nearly bought it as well, and then I, then I saw it in Primark. Um, and I also made a purchase actually my mum got these for me because i asked for these for christmas and for some reason i don't think the payment went through and um it was like five days after christmas i was like wait didn't we order something from bodyline and um she was sent no tracking code and on her paypal it didn't say that the money went through so yeah so i've got these now um i couldn't decide on a color so i got three <laughs> in different colorways i got the blue i got the cream they actually say that it's white on uh on the website but they're actually cream i was a bit disappointed because i wanted white ones but who's gonna know and the pink ones and i have like a lot of um fairy k things that will go with this and then i found this i thought it was cute <laughs> um it was i think it was about two pound so i was like girl you can't go wrong it's pink and purple okay uh that's everything so i hope you enjoyed my whole video so if i rushed it i'm just trying to cut down on the length of my videos because i talk a lot so i'll see you next time bye, -bye.